Hello YouTube, B3, you're back with another kicking action figure collection update. Yeah, we're gonna start this one off real quick. Show you some recent stuff. This is a Christmas present of mine that I didn't show in the last couple updates. Uh, the Red Xenomorph Warrior from the NECA Aliens line. Very, very cool figure. A friend of mine got it because he thought that my one from the two-pack was broken. But it's actually my black one from the two-pack that's broken. But it's good because I wanted another Red Xenomorph. But at the same time, I didn't want to buy one because I already had a red xenomorph, so I, it actually worked out pretty well. But yeah, you know, I'm very glad he got me this guy. And now let's take a look at some of the other stuff we have. Alright, now here's the stuff that's at my apartment. First off, I'm going to show you a bunch of Star Wars Black Series figures. First up, we have the Star Wars Black Series Darth Vader. This is the regular one, not the Walmart exclusive one, obviously. And uh, he's pretty cool. Got him on Amazon with gift cards, so, you know, he didn't really cost me anything. And, uh... I got a bunch of other Star Wars figures and stuff. I've been couponing, so I can afford a few more figures now for you guys. You're welcome. X-Wing pilot Asti from The Force Awakens. I think I'm pronouncing his name right. I just wanted, you know, an X-Wing pilot. I don't have a lot of Resistance characters. Um, I have mostly First Order characters, so... Yeah, I thought he was a real interesting looking figure, so I picked him up. Plus I loved uh, the movie. And, of course, First Order TIE Fighter pilot. You know, gotta have another pilot. I'd love to get the one with the giant TIE Fighter, but I'm never going to get that. Just can't afford it. Just cannot afford it. So, yeah, pretty dope. And then I got a bit of an older Black Series figure. It's a Star Wars Black Series Han Solo Stormtrooper. Yeah, I had the Luke Skywalker Stormtrooper already, as you guys have already seen. So, you know. Just picked it up. Let's swap these guys. Yeah, that's nice. So a bunch of clone troopers and stuff as well. Uh, you can see most of these in my action figure hunt video. My friend Jimmy and I, who uh, we make videos together, and we did an action figure hunt video. And then a figure that they finally re-released uh, in January. Uh, it's a Black Series Ray. She was great in the movie. I was crushing a little bit, actually. She's really cool. So yeah, I'm very glad that they re-released Ray. She's everywhere now, thank God. Ah, I'm glad. I'm very glad. And then lastly, one more first order is the first order Snowtrooper. I should have got the Toys R Us exclusive one when I had the chance, but I didn't. Which is my, my mistake. My very big mistake. Because this is a pretty dope looking figure. Can't wait to add it to my first order. And I think there's a Flame Trooper or something coming out too. I cannot wait for that. So that's all the Black Series we just got. And now I'm going to show you some more things. Some... More Hasbro figures, Marvel Legends. Uh, here we have the Ghost Rider from the Rhino Build a Figure Wave. Very, very cool, you know. Oh, crud. Goes <laughs> uh, by Heroes for Hire on here. He's the running change of uh, Misty Knight, which is weird because Misty Knight comes with the same piece that uh, White Tiger comes with. So I think that's a little odd that these two are actually running changes together. You know, Heroes for Hire does make sense for Misty Knight, though. Um, I'll just say that, but yeah, so Marvel figure, pretty dope, and uh, also another Marvel legend, we have Kraven the Hunter here, also from the Rhino build, a figure wave, Savage Force is running changes, the Chameleon, I got both these guys at uh, Target, I think, but yeah, so there's another Marvel Legends right there. And then one more Marvel Legends. It is yet another Rhino figure. It's the Chameleon that you just saw. Uh, I think I paid a little too much for him, actually. He was 25 bucks at Kmart, which I think is kind of a rip, honestly. So, we're just going to lay him down right there because I'm running out of room since I'm doing this in package. And we got one more figure. This one's DC from Batman vs. Superman. I had to get it because my Man is still Superman didn't scale up. So it's the Superman from that movie. Uh, I guess I'm going to get this whole first half of the wave. I don't think I'm going to get all of the 5 through 8 coming up. But I'm going to get all of these, I guess. Uh, I got him $5 off with a coupon. So, that's pretty cool. Now, um, quick recap. In Marvel Legends, we have Kraven the Hunter, Ghost Rider, and the Chameleon from, you know, the Rhino build, the figure wave. So only one more figure to go before I complete Rhino, and then you guys can have a review of him. And then we have the Star Wars Black Series Ray, First Order TIE Fighter Pilot, Han Solo Stormtrooper, X-Wing Pilot Asti, First Order Stormtrooper, and Darth Vader. And then we also have the Mattel Batman vs. Superman Superman figure from the DC Multiverse line. So, yeah, that is that for my action figure 
haul, you guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to write, comment, subscribe. Check out all the cool links in the description below. Facebook, Twitter, etc. You can check out our action figure reviews on our toy channel. It's called Godzilla and Gigan. So if you want to see reviews of all these guys, and I will be reviewing all these guys, you can check that out. Uh, but yeah, that's it. Thank you all so much, and I'll see you all later.